So I'll be here now. I'm going to run you through my wash day. And I'm going to be using the LUS brand shampoo and conditioner. They are probably one of the most hydrating shampoos that I use in my hair. Um, and it's easy to comb and it's my favourite. So we're going to go straight on with this. And then we're going to move on and use the Floracurl Clay Deep Conditioner. So, so I don't judge the state of my hair. I used some stuff to style it the other day that just did it great. So this is what my hair is looking like right now. I'm wet this and then we'll go on with the shampoo. Okay, so you can see my hair soaking wet. Hair is on top wash this because no, so. so you just want to massage this into your scalp get rid of all of that build up and I'm not usually a shampoo fan and um, probably only shampoo my hair twice a month just because I do find that shampoos leave my hair feeling horrible but this is one of those few that doesn't and it's sulfate free as well so so just make sure you work it all in and it does blather you can see I've not had a lot of build up on my hair but I am giving it a good swab because I have co-washed the last two weeks and I haven't deep conditioned properly so I want to get rid of all of that build up and then I'm going to go ahead and rinse that off so that's all rinsed off and without me even putting conditioner in my hair like my fingers can just comb it which for just shampoo alone I'm like wow but you need to and obviously you get your fallout from doing that to condition my hair I like to break it into two sections sometimes more as I said it depends how long I've left it between wash days if I haven't washed my hair in an actual four weeks then I will section my hair into smaller sections but as I only washed my hair on Saturday it's not really that bad and you just want to start with the ends just work that through your hair I like to finger detangle as I go because it makes it easier to comb it later on and if you're going to be deep conditioning your hair, then you need to be combing it. You need deep conditioners to penetrate all of your hair. Oh, guys, look how long it is when it's wet. I can't get it all in the camera. I wish it stayed this long. Shrinkage. Obviously, as a curly girl, we use a lot of conditioner. Just pull that all through. I think as well, when you finger detangle as you condition in your hair, you'll see like, look how much hair comes out. But then you lose a lot more from combing. Combing is obviously harsher on your hair. So I like to use a wide tooth shower comb. I got this at Asda, which is part of Walmart here in America. Um, but you can get these anywhere. They're just easier especially if you've got it's such a mess in the bathroom it's gonna kill me you've got thicker hair like me then having the, the wide tooth is gonna be a lot easier for you there's no point getting a comb that has tiny tiny little gaps between you're just gonna pull out a lot of your hair so you can see this conditioner just makes it so easy to comb through your hair. Like, I haven't combed my hair since Saturday, guys. <laughs> and it's just easy and tangle free. 
straight on one side. I like to twist that section off. And again, the shampoo has made my hair really manageable and it's still really soft. You know when you get shampoos that dry your hair out and your hair feels like straw and you just want to cry like, oh my god. Yeah, this is not one of those. <laughs> this is totally safe to use and moisturising for your hair. Yeah, if you get any big knots, just don't be afraid to just like pull them a little bit. As long as you're not yanking your hair from your root, you're not going to cause any damage by separating it. And if you didn't know guys, if you live in the UK, LUS Band is also available on naturalistic products. Um, as well as getting it from their own website, they don't actually have the huge shipping fee. Um, I think, because I got the mini versions first, and I got them direct off the website, it didn't cost me an arm and a leg to get hold of them. So you have two options where you can get these from. And they have a different, like it's the same three products, but they have one for curls, one for waves, and one for kinks. So no matter what your hair type is like, they do cater for you. Which is really good. So again, like so much hair falls out. I'll have to show you at the end like how much hair I actually use on a wash day. Make sure when you comb your hair, no matter what you're using to comb it, always start at the end and work your way up because otherwise you're just gonna rip out your hair. Because if you get a big knot in the top, you're just pulling it down into more knots. And this is where my hair tangles the most. This little back bit here, which is why I always section down the middle into two. To make sure that I always get those tangles out. Of work. And when you're happy you've got everything out, you can go ahead and rinse that off so this is what it looks like with the conditioner in and ignore my roots they are getting sorted soon because i finally decided to stay blonde i'm going to go ahead and rinse this off and then we'll go for the next part okay so that's rinsed and my hair is in my towel and we will move on and go on to the next part which is the deep conditioning mask my hair is clean and actually dried on this one but this is my hair without any product in it now it has just been washed with the LUS shampoo and conditioner the curl one but it feels so soft and fluffy like oh my god I'm actually tempted to not do the next part and just leave this I was gonna do this, so this is the what I'm gonna put on my hair, and it is the Flora Curl Curl Refresh Clay Wash, and I got the set that comes with the little mixer bowl and the little stirrer, so I'm gonna use them with it, and my section clips to keep my hair separate. So my hair dried a little quicker than I thought it was gonna, and um, so I'm gonna be using a spray bottle which is rolled water mixed with just normal water just to re-dampen the bits that have dried so there's instructions on the back so it says to blend two tablespoons with two tablespoons of water so in my little tub that's what I'm going to do so you just want to I think I've only used this once before and I ended up needing a lot more than two. My hair is very thick. Water. And 
and then it does come with a little this is why I say I'm gonna need more last time I did it in two lots I don't even know if that's the right consistency but it did a good job so we're gonna go with that so You just want it to be wet. And then get some of your mixture. Thick, it is clay. I was really worried the first time I used this, and I think I mentioned it in my blog review because it does leave your hair feeling super hard. Um, but that's just because it's clay. Once you rinse it off, it's a completely different story. Like your hair is super soft. So twist that off. And we'll move on to the next section. So you want to repeat it and then we'll move on. Okay, so that's all on. And I like to do six sections when I do condition. I just think six is enough. Um, and actually, I actually made enough for my whole hair because it was really, really thick. But once I rubbed it between my hands, it was really creamy. So what we're going to do next is pop our twists up and just plastic shower cap. And I got these plastic shower caps from Superdrug. If you don't have a plastic shower cap, you can use a plastic bag. I've done that plenty of times and it works just the same. So we're going to leave this on for about 10, 15 minutes. But I'm going to be using sheets today. So we'll move on to the third room in the house that I'm showing you today. And show you how I'm going to be using sheets to get this mask. I'm going to be using this hair steamer today to do my mask with heat so so all your hair is in the steamer so that is all rinsed off the definition in those curls. Good work. Now for styling and I'm going to be using the LUS leave-in which is an all-in-one really. So I'm going to start off with that first and I'm going to just work that off through. And then what I'm going to do is go back section from earlier. One or two pumps per section. You don't need a lot. It's just that much. Okay, because as I'm trying to film this, my cat is trying to get my attention. So, I seem distracted, that'd be why. Cultivated in products. I use the Only Curls Curl Cream. If you've read my blog post on this, you'll know that it's very watery look at that you do not need a lot of this at all you want to just same thing just break it through i just love how this comes out Diamond brush on wash day, but 
but I think that sometimes the Denman brush card is more shrinkage than any other way, so I'm not going to be doing that today. Break it through, break it through. And then I finally got my hands on the gel from Only Tales as well. So this is the first time using it. So, oh, very creamy for a gel. And it's not, ooh, okay. So this time I'm gonna rub it in and use the praying hands method. So get your hair and just pull. I don't wanna rake this time because when you pull, you will clump your curls. And obviously if you rake, you're gonna destroy the clumps. So you really wanna clump it. Just twist that section off when you're done. I can already tell that I'm going to love this gel. I don't like sticky gels. Sticky gels are just annoying and tend to flake. So, this is more of a creamy gel. You wouldn't even think that's a gel. Again, clump the curls. Oh my god. I think I am in love already. You don't have to twist off the sections. I just think it keeps it tangle free and it also keeps those curls clumped while you do the rest of your hair. I try to um, do this without this step once um, and I just got mixed up with where I was up to. <laughs> Maybe that's just me. I don't know. I'm going to go off camera and do the rest of it and then come back and we'll unload them together. So that's all sections done and I'm going to just gently unravel. When you're doing this, do not want to pull and cause a knot. It's drying really quickly. I don't know if it's the gel, because I've not wrapped my hair up in a towel, but it's actually drying quite quick. Which is a good thing, because I much prefer to air dry. But I'm really, really happy with those results. Like, it's defined, it's curly, it feels so soft. I'm really happy with this result. And my camera's out of focus. There you go, you can probably see that better now. So those are the products that I used today and I will be using these again together. Like, oh my god, I am so in love with my hair right now. I'm kind of gutted that I'm not actually going anywhere. Maybe it <laughs> but yeah, so these are all available, including the clay mask that I used today, are available on naturalistic products as well as on their own websites. Only Curls London has the cutest packaging. Like, they give you sweeties. So, 100% recommend these products and a full review of the gel will be coming soon. I'm obviously going to use it a few more times. Today was just a first impression and it's a good one. So yeah, thanks for watching.